Here again is a view of the sympathetic chain ganglia. And notice that on this model, you only see the sympathetic chain on one side. So let's just, uh, you can assume that it is, of course, on both sides, but only shown on one side in this model. Now, the neurons, the cell bodies of the neurons that are within the uh, sympathetic chain ganglia are postganglionic neurons that are going to exit and go to various places in the body. Now, these sympathetic neurons are going to go to various places in the body, including structures in the head and structures in the pelvic region. So, you're going to you can find the sympathetic chain ganglia going all the way up past the ganglia associated with T1 and it going up and extending into the neck. So here you can see three neck ganglia and this is going to be the inferior cervical ganglion and the middle and the superior cervical ganglion. So these three cervical ganglion are part of this sympathetic chain. And as we go back in the other direction towards the inferior structures in the pelvis, you can see that the ganglia will continue to extend all the way into the sacral region. And you'll even have one in the coccyx supplying structures uh, that are associated with the peri perianal region.